we're trying to collect together the beginnings of the show. One starting point is a book I wrote called Centrally Heated Knickers, which is a book of poems about science. And the other starting point is some collaborative work that I've done with the Homemade Orchestra, where they took some poems I've written and put them together with their own music that they composed and they played. The people upstairs are making a horrible noise. We know who it is, it's Billy's Bully Boys. One of three musicians, uh, and uh, our role is, is, is very much to kind of dream up a kind of sound world. And that's something that, that we're really, that feels really kind of exciting, that we're kind of looking at the nature of sound and trying to kind of ignite and enthuse children in, in discovering about science, being interested in science, learn about science, and, and using all these different art forms to kind of bring that to life. I love hybrid. Anything that mixes the things that people think are pure, you know, I write poems. It's possible to stand up and read a poem and then sit down again. That's very kind of pure. It's possible to get up and play a piece of music and sit down, and that's fine. But I think something exciting happens the moment you create hybrid forms, where you start marrying poetry with music, with film, with acting that isn't connected to the poetry, that you've got props that may or may not be directly connected, props in the broader sense of the word, set, style, and so on. And I think exciting things happen. So then you've, it's really like sparks between poles, that if you've got a poetry pole and you've got a, uh, a music pole, then pachong, the thing that happens between the two is then exciting for an audience. The city winks, I'm cold, and the bus sails on. The exciting thing about this project is just uh, making things connect, making the visual, the sound and the text all work together in some new way. We hope to raise most of the money to develop, rehearse, build and stage this new show from the Arts Council and the Wellcome Trust. But unfortunately, they can't fund everything. We want to keep tickets affordable and workshops and resources free, and so we would really appreciate it if you could give a little or a lot, and help us raise the missing funds.